This is Duke University. My name's Arwen Buholtz and I'm the Recycling and Waste Reduction Coordinator here at Duke. And this is a Garbology. So we're standing out on the West Campus Quad today. Um, we've got some student volunteers and we're going through one of the dumpsters from the administrative building here on campus to determine what materials in that dumpster could have been recycled. Students are very visual and to have a mound of stinking, heaping garbage sends out the message just it's a little more direct. I mean, a day's worth is a dumpster full, and that's a lot of trash. We actually pull the bags of trash out of the dumpster. We dump them on the tarp, and then the students, as you can see, are going through the trash bit by bit, pulling out the recyclables. I got extra suits. Yeah, come on. Come on, come on. Come on Matt. I'm going to make what? you do this. First, welcome to Duke. Guys. I'll do it Good. Thank you, Matt. We're hoping to educate students and faculty and staff about what is and is not recyclable and just how much of what is being thrown away we have a system to deal with in the recycling department. It's pretty shocking how much waste we produce in the first place and then to realize how uh, poorly a job we do at uh, separating what is reusable, what is recyclable. We added it up and there was uh, 91 pounds of recycling and 112.5 pounds of trash. 45% of the material could have been recycled. Yeah, it's a lot. I think part of every recycling program's largest challenge, especially on larger campuses, is to reach out to the community on that campus to teach them exactly what is and isn't recyclable. We're getting there and Duke does a great job recycling, but we always have room for improvement. Produced by Duke University, online at duke.edu.